My inverter can run on just solar without a battery. Can yours? Okay, question one. You have no money, but you still want to run a, a cheap small inverter, but you don't want to expend a lot of money on expensive batteries, which is the biggest cost in solar setup. Can it be done? Yes, it can. Using an inexpensive DC to DC converter. I know, I know, another video using a DC to DC converter. I must have a fetish for these things. <laughs> uh, I think these are really handy. I think every household should own at least one of these. This is a step down converter. This is stepping down my 34 watt solar panels. I've got two 250 watt solar panels in parallel, making 500 watts. That's going into my DC converter. And as you can see, my pure sine wave inverter is working. So this is very similar to a house setup, house solar, except this is a portable off-grid solar. This will still work even if there's disruption in the power network. Can I just use my 12 volt solar panel and plug it directly into this inverter? That should work, shouldn't it? Well, technically no, because your 12 volt solar panel normally has an open voltage of above 18 volts, which will be too high for your 12 volt inverter. So regardless, you'd still need a DC to DC converter to be safe. All right, I'm using 14 watts now what else can I power of this and how much power can I get out of this little setup here that I've got excuse the mess guys but charging this Ryobi battery now charging this Zotto battery now We're drawing 160 watts, 170 watts. This is a 250 VA inverter, so roughly around 200 watt inverter, 190 to 200 watt inverter. We're pulling close to that. Let's see if we'll run this fan as well. As you see the inverter fan came on so we're pretty well pushing this thing now to the inverter's capacity. Very cool. Once again guys if you find value out of these videos please like, subscribe, comment below. Any ideas, any suggestions. I appreciate and read all your comments. I appreciate your support. Cheers, guys. Just keep in mind, guys, this is all running off just solar and this DC to DC converter. There's no expensive batteries, no expensive charge controllers. I think this is pretty cool. And hope it gives you another idea of how you can set up these systems cheap without having to go out and expend lots and lots of money where something like this may be suited for your needs. Yeah, conclusion for this is a yay or an nay. I'd say this is a yay. Guys, what are your guys' thoughts? I reckon this is a very usable system. This can, as long as the sun's shining, this could be a very valid option for some people. So yeah, let us know what you think down below and thanks for watching.